All right, guys, here she is, my T-slotted aluminum rig. Um, I like the setup. I like the flexibility. Um, you can you can customize these things however you want. Um, it's um, in that regards, it's it's pretty good setup. Um, it's very sturdy. Uh, there is some there's more planning involved in this than there is with wood uh, just because there's yeah, more things to uh, that that become permanent or harder to move anyways um, than the wood ones I've got these guys attached here I know someone wanted to see a close-up of how they're attached alright sit right in there in this little this little groove that goes in here there's a little single um, uh, internal um, fastener that goes on the inside you slide them through that was one of the things that I had to kind of um, I had to kind of pre-plan or I should have pre-planned better because I there were, there were several times when I had to take it back apart because I forgot to put in the fasteners and in, in the certain t-slots uh, that it would need but uh, anyway, so I've got these guys in here. Um, they're all just tension tightened. Uh, they uh, these screws were a little bit big, so I just put washers in. I had a bunch of these washers, and um, to uh, get the required amount of tension, um, I didn't feel like ordering new screws or a bolt or whatever for for them. But um, they are very secure. Um, the back the back just sits on this back rail um, you know it seemed to uh, seem to work out just fine um, but yeah overall it's been a it's been a good good project uh, they all seem to be in there securely I've, I've fired it up I, I haven't uh, I my my pool table is not my it's not part of my rig room so um, it's just right here while I was building it and, and you know had a had good light or whatever so uh, give you a quick little walk around here it's all uh, you know business in the front there and uh, there's definitely a party in the back um, I do have cable management although it looks uh, looks crazy but anyone that has rigs and especially rigs of this size there's only so much cable management you can do. You're never going to make the back look uh, look look tight. But there may be a few things here and there that I change. One of the things that I look for is I try to make sure that none of the cables are are really blocking. I don't want them grouped up and blocking the back where the, the air is is getting sucked in. Um, so if I when I fire it up, if I see some cars are running hotter than others, then I'll usually I'll try to single them out and see if I can't. Um, figure out and or or verify or ensure that you know some of these aren't botched or clumped up together behind a card and obstructing the airflow but so there there it is two Z270A motherboards um, the rig on the left is 1080 uh, the rig on the right is 1070s. Ultimately, I think I'm going to. I've already started getting in stuff to um, make this into a water cooled rig. Um, I'm going to run a parallel system. It's going to come in probably from this side. As you can see, when these shrouds are off too, I mean they're they're cut in half. So I'll be able to take all of these cards up in the bottom and move them right into the slots and I'll have all 19 or uh, all 18 that go along the top so they're just gonna run parallel parallel loop all the way across the top alright and then it's gonna come to a I've got my radiator that'll go here on the side and it will outlet around to my reservoir which will be in the back um, I just I'm just curious to see what water cooling will do for it if it will help me reduce heat in my room um, or not you know the heat still gotta go somewhere I know it's going in the radiator the radiator's gotta blow it out somewhere so um, 
it'll be interesting interesting to see I, I've got a I bought a little bit bigger pump than normal it's a fish tank pump so uh, it can push out a higher volume and it has a little bit higher head pressure so there you go guys there's my new rig uh, let me know if you have any questions comments or want to see close-ups on anything see ya